A summit in Kinshasa, the capital of the Democratic Republic of Congo, DRC, aimed at protecting Central Africa's rainforest has ended with a commitment to make food systems in the Congo Basin more viable. The three-day regional summit on climate change, biodiversity conservation and food systems saw 230 participants argue for conservation efforts to address food security for locals. Let us call on international organizations, donors, sub-regional institutions, governments, non-governmental organizations, local communities, indigenous peoples and all stakeholders to unite in the mission to safeguard the Congo Basin. Covering 1.62 million square kilometers, the forest of Central Africa represents the planet's second largest carbon sink after the Amazon. The moment we had during these three days of work will remain unforgettable because I remain convinced that this summit will result in projects that will make food systems in the Congo Basin more viable, while at the same time giving priority to assets linked to the fight against climate change for the benefit of our communities and all humanity. The DRC is home to 60% of the vast Congo Basin rainforest, making it a key player in the fight against climate change. A government ministerial commission in April recommended terminating 30 forest concessions due to alleged irregularities.